Right now, some Georgia voters are already heading back to the polls for the Senate runoff race. Early voting is officially underway in Douglas County two weeks ahead of the December 6th election. For those of you who vote in Douglas County, early voting locations are right here for you on your screen. One is the Douglas County Courthouse. There are seven total polling locations that will offer early voting both today and tomorrow from 8.30 a.m. to 6 p.m. We spoke with voters today and one woman told us voting is very important to her and her family. When I was growing up, my mother wasn't able to vote. I think the first time she voted was when we moved to Atlanta in 68. So voting is uh, it's just something we don't think about. It's as easy as getting up in the morning and doing anything else that's responsible like going to work. The Cab County will start to offer early voting tomorrow and Saturday and Gwinnett County, Fulton and Cobb as well will offer early voting starting on Saturday. Joe Hinkey joins us now as details of how early voting this upcoming Saturday are once again being challenged in court, Joe, and this comes as counties are already making plans to have polling locations open. Well, Jennifer, the state Republican Party and Republican National Committee appealed the case today to the state Supreme Court asking for Saturday voting to not be allowed after last night the state appeals court ruled Saturday voting will be allowed for the runoff. The legal challenge here focuses on a state law prohibiting early voting on a Saturday if that date follows a state holiday on a Thursday or Friday. The Secretary of State's office earlier this month said the Thanksgiving holiday would prevent Saturday voting during the runoff. The state Democratic Party, Warnock campaign and other groups though filed a lawsuit saying that law does not impact runoffs and so far a Fulton County judge in the state appeals court has agreed. We have confirmed 16 or about 10% of Georgia counties will offer Saturday voting. This morning, Get Out the Vote groups made a plea for more counties to add Saturday voting. The back and forth makes it difficult for counties. But we are hopeful that more counties will add it, and that's why we're making the call to action for every single county to do it. And the state Supreme Court is now giving the Democratic Party of Georgia and Warnock campaign until tomorrow morning to file a response to the Republicans appeal. So we are not expecting the state's highest court to rule on Saturday voting until tomorrow morning at the earliest. Coming up at six, the reason why I'm told for some voters Saturday could be their only chance to cast a ballot with Election Day coming up on December 6th. Ron. Okay, Joe, we will see you at six o'clock, sir.